really tried their food so i don't know if it's very good it's a bad dad joke but um it's interesting because they're like legit in grocery stores like you can go get their products they're a vegan company right but then again i'm not vegan but i do imagine that it's oh there's always going to be a space for like this vegan shit holy crap like the lighting's just horrible in here let's fix it up man All right, that's not any better, but I'm lazy today. But here we go. This is what I'm looking at, man. What I find interesting is how we're at like such a low range. This is the lowest the stock's ever been. And we get these huge kind of days where somebody's buying up the stock, right? So if I'm looking from a technical perspective, I'm watching like this level right here because we can't break up over it for some reason. And it seems like that's where we top out really in this 47 cent range. So what was happening in my opinion here is that I will also want to watch this lower floor, right? Um, it could be just someone who bought a massive amount here and then is having like his, uh, his sell order at this level. And then he sells all the shares up here and people who are trying to buy into it right they can't really break it there might be a massive supply up here so they can't break but um, in order for this kind of pattern to kind of stay intact right you want to see this range right here get hold this 24 cent range so again I don't know much about the company <laughs> I don't know much about the company right but when I'm looking at a stock from the technical perspective this is just what I'm always going to pay attention to. Well, one, I'm a little bit biased because I participated in nice gains back in 2020. So um, I do think that could come back around, right? You just It might just need some time, simply that. Like right now, also take into consideration the market's kind of, it's been really choppy, right? So you're going to see this across the board. The stock's like 90 something percent down plus. So, um, if this is something like you're interested in, like have a plan on what you want to do and kind of, uh, you know, if you think this is a company worth investing in, invest wisely and only invest in a mode that you're willing to lose because anything could really happen, right? Like take it, what I say with a grain of salt, um, I'm, I'm watching this stock. I have no money in it because in order for me to buy this, I want to see large volume coming in. And I want to see us break up above this 46 cent range. And if that were to happen, it's a different story because then we want to tackle potentially the dollar range or the 90 cent range, which is a little bit more interesting. So um, for now, this one's on a hard watch. Peace. <laughs>